Why don't we do loads of abs? This one's for you ladies. The reason is, is because bench press can probably get you abs a little bit quicker. Let me explain. So the female way of thinking is that we need to, we have our problem area, like our stomach, so we need to directly exercise that to achieve a flatter midsection or just a set of abs or anything. We need to directly do lots and lots of direct ab work to reduce belly fat. We also need to do lots of direct ab work to get a stronger core. So is this correct? Obviously, in some ways, that can be aimed as being correct, but it's very unlikely that that's gonna give you the outcome you want by having that approach. So what's the truth about abs? If you want a flat stomach, ladies, you're gonna to have to control your calorie consumption. I know that's a pretty obvious thing to say, but never ever look for doing more sit-ups to reduce belly fat. Belly fat is never ever gonna happen. Right? So we need to control our calories to display our abs. That is a given. Right? So we need to sit down and eat decent meals, not snacking on rubbish or not generally snacking. Sitting down eating, eating meals is going to get our abs a lot quicker than sit up ever would. We need that education of how many calories we should be consuming on a regular basis. And that will help us obviously get a fat stomach in that time. Now, if it was that simple, if it was that easy, then everybody would be walking around in a really lean position and personal trainers wouldn't have a job. But it's not that simple, it's not that easy, and I 100% sympathize with everybody trying to achieve their best body shape they possibly can. But ladies, I want you to really understand what I'm saying. We need to have a fixed, strong weight training plan in place for us to be able to achieve the outcome with some abs. So at THQ, we hit a few abs, but it's not a priority because weight training uses nutrients for energy. So we want you to get stronger on them big lifts like chest press, shoulder press, rows, squats. These are gonna use more calories. So over the seven days, you are gonna lose more body fat because you're burning more energy. So this is gonna make it a lot more flexible with your lifestyle as well, because we can eat more calories over the seven days, so we can have, still have the treats and things like that, and we're still gonna be able to reduce body fat. By getting stronger from top to toe, by doing squats, chest press, shoulder press, that is gonna get our core strong. Yes, we can chuck in a few planks and a few things like that, but if we're deadlifting and we're squatting, our core, core is gonna be strong. So if you think you need to do sit-ups and planks and things for a stronger core, just focus on getting as strong as you possibly can from a full body workout, and I promise your core will be very, very stable and very strong. So do we need to hit abs at, at all? Of course we do, right? Yes, abs are made in the kitchen, as in like we need to not eat rubbish a lot at a time and eat better to have a nice set of abs. But if we don't train a muscle and abs are a muscle, then we're not gonna have, it's not gonna be well developed. But we don't have to train them anywhere near as much as what you think, no way near. So once we get a good body and our food's good and it's consistent and we're strong from top to toe, top to toe and we're getting all the benefits from that, what I've spoke about, then Maybe we can just chuck in a few abs from here and there and maybe when we're on a stricter plan and we're really on a strict goal, then we can focus on abs a little bit more. Like if any females, when you do a shoot, we focus on abs quite a bit towards the end because every other variable, food, training, everything is taken care of. So hitting them abs as well a little bit more on top is gonna help us um, achieve that outcome of having that nice midsection a little bit better. But the main thing is we need to get you strong from top to toe. So ladies, if you want faster results, if you want to achieve the results that you've set out to do, then please listen to us faster. The females that spend less time with us trying to convince them that lifting weights, getting strong, eating a high protein diet is gonna get them better results, 
then the quicker their results are going to be and the motivation stays high. We don't want to spend ages. Now, males are dead easy to convince. They all want to eat loads of meats and fish and lift heavy weights and rah. Females don't necessarily want to do that instantly, but the quicker you listen to us, the quicker you do the things we want you to do, and the better and faster results that you're going to get and your motivation will be a lot higher.